Are you? <laughs> so I won't take too much of your time, but I just want to talk about this uh, vaping a bit. So it's really great that you all are here because vaping is a really recent issue. So last year, uh, one of my friends in one of my classes, he took something out of his sweatshirt pocket and he put it under his sweatshirt. And then he pulled it into his mouth and then he blew. He sucked on it and then <sighs> in class. See, I heard of these things called vapes, but I didn't quite know what you did with them. I, I knew it was bad, but I didn't even know, I didn't know what it was. So as I observed more and more in school, I saw that a lot of people were doing the same thing. In fact, this thing is such a widespread issue, but I, I didn't even know it existed. And the reason is that vaping, you can't tell a person's vaping. There's no visible signs. Um, unless a person is maybe looking shady, you might think, hey, that guy is doing it. But you, you might not be sure. But instead, maybe like a nice, polite kid, he might be the one vaping. So going back to my friend this time, when he was working, he had one hand on the keyboard and the other in his sweatshirt pocket. So he wasn't vaping, so I was wondering, what is he doing? So I, being the curious me, I asked him, what are you doing, man? And he replied, I can't concentrate without having my vape in my hand. So that's when I realized how big of an issue this is. The, the guy couldn't even concentrate without having the vape in his hand. So. I, I kind of decided that it, it's something that needs to change. So in another one of my classes, uh, this other kid, uh, who I knew vaped, uh, I've saw him a few times before, so he asked to go to the bathroom. That's where usually vaping happens. So I, I thought of this as an opportunity, and I was like, I got to do something about this. So I also asked to go to the bathroom. So there, I saw this guy sharing his vape with his friends. And that's when I was kind of, I was hit morally. I, I, I couldn't believe it. So I asked him, Are you, are, aren't you ashamed of what you're doing? And he said, what should I be ashamed of? And I said, not only are you ruining your health, you're ruining the health of those around you, so are you not ashamed of doing what you're doing? And he's like, take it easy, man. It's, it's, it's not that bad. It, it, just chill. It's, it's, it, everyone does it. It's not bad. So... That's when I realized that people need to be educated. Not many people know that this issue exists. Not many people know the long-term effects of vaping. So when I, when I was thinking of how best to send this message, I decided that just going and confronting people wouldn't work. I tried that before. So when I was thinking, how best can I s send this message, I thought maybe the people first need to be educated about this. They need to understand why it's bad and what it does to you. So that's when uh, I was thinking, hey, maybe putting this message along with entertainment is the best way to do this. And that's when my friends, Karthik, Shriya, Manu, and Amishek Anna, they made this a reality. They helped me make this a reality. So this, this show is the product of that thought. So I really hope you're, you enjoy this show, but I also uh, really hope that you can take back a message from this show and uh, apply it in your lives. Thank you so much.